Welcome to the Friary. Come on in. It only takes a step inside. To your right here is the formal dining room. You have the formal living room here on the left. With Maryland's top agent, Brad Capel, to know this 23-acre estate and $20 million listing is something else. Well, come on in to one of the most interesting rooms in the whole home. This is the original chapel. With a history dating back to the 1920s, the property once housed monks. Now aptly called the Friary, the mansion has seven bedrooms, 13 bathrooms, and history in every corner. Right through here, there is a secret, not so secret anymore, panel that you push and this takes you down to where the previous underground railroad tunnel was where they used to bring up arms and people and hide them out in the home. With two indoor and outdoor pools, this 35,000 square foot Georgian style mansion is now up for auction. And there's even more history packed inside this house. This fireplace, for example, is Calcutta marble that comes from Michelangelo's quarry itself. And if you walk with me over here, take a look at these pleated curtains. These are licensed material from Mary Antoinette's dress itself. But to get in on all of this, you need $100,000 a deposit before you can start bidding. Capel says the week-long online auction starting this Thursday opens the bidding to international buyers no reserve. So what that means is once the auction begins, it's going to sell at the highest bidder. When the gavel strikes, it's going to sell. It's a cash transaction. There's no contingencies on inspections, no contingencies on title work. It's going to be done when that gavel strikes. Located right off the Severn River with, yes, its own private pier, the mansion has been on the market for some time. Furniture included in the sale, Capel says the real win here is the value. It's a value. It's a total deal. <laughs> a loaded deal for the Friary, now up for auction here in Maryland. In Annapolis, Amy Lou, WBAL-TV 11 News.